Yud is good. It's your boy Sam back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're gonna be dropping the ball for our free Galaxy Opal card in NBA 2K24. My team. You guys can see the Galaxy Opals you could get are Blake Griffin, Sean Marion, Jalen Green, John Wall, and Damian Lillard. Now, for me personally, I don't really care who I get. I probably would want Sean Marion, but again, to me, it's like, it really doesn't matter a whole ton, like who I get and who I don't get. Obviously, I, I think, you know, for me, Sean Marion's probably the ideal because I think at this small four position, he's probably the best at this position, specific position. If you don't have Austin Reeves, uh, you know, John Wall would be really solid. For me, it's a matter of this. Do you want a point guard or do you want a, a small forward? If you want a small forward, I drop the ball uh, to the middle or left side, middle left side. If you want a guard, I drop the ball to the middle right side, probably. That's where I'm at. Because either you're going to get John Wall or Sean Marion, probably. Now for me, I'm going to drop it in this middle left slot. And again, I just got to hope I get Sean Marion. If I don't get Sean Marion, I mean, it is what it is. Like, I'm not, I'm not against like anybody else Blake Griffin is just the guy I don't think is gonna play for me like gee I just don't and I don't hate Blake Griffin I think the card's fine but I just have a hard time seeing him play for me now how do you get the free galaxy up well you grind out all of these things it's actually a really relatively easy grind you do have to go into unlimited you do have to go into salary cap and so that's the one thing about it all for a galaxy opal who, like for me in this account could he play? I mean, maybe. I guess I could maybe find a way for Blake Griffin to play, but I just doubt he's going to find his way in my rotation more so than anything, just because, I mean, I don't think his release is going to be that next level good, and defensively, he's not going to be good. But it is something I recommend grinding, because even if I would have got John Wall, like John Wall is good. Even if you get Sean Marion, Sean Marion's good. And even for my No Money Spent Squad series, like these are guys that can definitely play. And, and I'm not trying to just, you know, gas him, but they definitely are guys that can play at a high level. And even this Blake Griffin, is he going to play for me? Probably not. And that's okay. But for like guys that are just starting the game or just, you know, grinding the game, looking for a new grind, you get a free Galaxy Open. Honestly, the only Galaxy Open was I really don't like is I don't love Dame and I don't love uh, Jalen Green. If you get John Wall, he's solid enough. Sean Marion, I don't love his release, but he's solid enough. And even Blake Griffin is solid enough. And so, yes, I got a free Galaxy Opa off of this bullet drop. I got Blake Griffin. I was going for Sean Marion. For me, honestly, it was it worth my time? Well, I'd say this. It was more so than anything because now I've got a bunch of gold eggs in my collection. Like, obviously, I can't do anything. It's not like I can exchange Blake Griffin for this. But I do have a bunch of gold eggs in my collection just waiting for this to reset in 38 minutes because once this resets... I'll lock in another one. And I think that's the bigger deal here is not only do you get a free Galaxy Opal, but you get a bunch of gold eggs as well that you ultimately can exchange. I do wish it was like a random Galaxy Opal pack with better Opals because like if you look at the Opals, I mean, Jalen Green's not good. Dame's not great. John Wall's okay, but he's undersized. Sean Mary and Blake Griffin are both okay at that small forward position. But it's not like we got a pack with the best Opals in the game. It's a free Opal for sure, and I'll take that. But the bigger thing for me is you're getting those gold eggs because I know Jarrell Wallace is on boards. I know Jalen Brown's on boards. I know you could get Jarrell Smith on boards as well. So that's the one thing for me. How long did it take me to do this egg hunt? I mean, I don't know. Combined, you have to play unlimited salary cap clutch. I mean, combined, you're probably looking a little over it. Probably three hours for the average person. For me, probably like two, two and a half. It's just realistic. But again, it's not that tough of a grind, especially once you get the unlimited dunks done. The rest of it really is not super difficult i just again wish for me that the galaxy opals were slightly better and and again maybe that's just me not being appreciative for what 2k gave us but i like i'm sorry a guy like uh at this stage a guy like sean marion doesn't excite me that much a guy like blake griffin really doesn't excite me even if i would have got john wall he doesn't excite me and maybe it's because my team's super good but even for my no money spent squad series 
it's a limited number of guys that really would have helped me out a ton. Like again, Sean Mary and Blake Griffin probably for sure would play on the nobody spent squad series, but I think it really is limited, uh, you know, in the opals they could have given us. Like they could have given us Braun, Giannis, oh, Hakeem, all of some of the best opals in the game, but they really limited it to uh, uh, some just very average, mediocre opals. Like, am I mad with Blake Griffin? No, I think the card's just fine. It's just like he's not an on ball defender. He's not necessarily the best option offensively and I just don't have a spot for him in my team I mean I think Jokic is better than Blake Griffin and so for me it is going to be tough to ultimately run him but uh, again if you get John Wall he can obviously play if you get a different guy uh you know they can obviously play like Sean Marion Blake John Wall for sure can even Damian Lillard Jalen Green like they're still opals they're still gonna be just fine on the court to me though they're just not those ultimate guys that you are hoping for when you do go to ultimately drop the ball so for me what's next that's a lot like like that's the next question like i've grinded for a galaxy Opal. i dropped the ball who did i get i got blake griffin i probably grind this bracket buster spotlight continue to grind for eggs and hope for the best on the ascension but that's where i'm at right now like i, I i've been a top grinder i've been grinding the game a ton and that is hopefully what i'm going to ultimately continue to do now one nice thing is if you do grind the game a bunch i think you should be able to on mobile uh you know lock in on um you should uh it looks like earn up to seven golden eggs by getting one dunk in different game modes on my team mobile like I don't understand, uh, like, if on mobile, if you do it, there will be something different. Maybe you'll, there will be, like, a special on mobile as well. But maybe that's what I'll look at. Either way, I should be able to do my exchanges on mobile, like, once every hour to continue doing the Ascension to level up my account. Again, I wish I would have got Sean Marion. But at the end of the day, even if I got Sean Marion, my small forward position stacked. I got... I got, you know, Zion, I got James Worthy, I got Dennis Rodman, now I got Blake Griffin, but I mean, my small forward position was stacked, my point guard position was stacked, Galaxy Opal was a nice get for the average guy, but for my account, I've got basically all the free cards we could have so far, and at this stage, it's just tough, because they are not going to probably play for me. Let me know who you guys get out of that ball drop, and who you guys want down below in the comments. I feel like overall, John Wall is probably your best option, so John Wall, Sean Marion, Blake Griffin, then I'll probably... Uh, uh, you got Jalen. I'd probably go Jalen Green and then Damian Lillard just because Dame is very small. But at least you have some different options. And at the end of the day, guys, go for the Opal you want. I can tell you who is the best, who, is, who you guys should go for. At the end of the day, number one, you might not even get the guy you want. And number two, it is all preference based. I just wanted to show you guys who I got out of my Opal pack and where they fit in my squad. Again, to be honest, none of those Opals are that great that they play for me. It is a card to add to my card collector level though. So like, and I know it's not that big of a deal, but Blake Griffin, I'll take you, I'll add you to the squad. It's just sad you're never probably going to see the floor for me. That's gonna wrap it up for our free Opal in NBA 2K24, my team. Let me know your thoughts, who you got down below in the comments. Drop a like on the video, subscribe if you're new. And as always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.